Wow! That was cool! Have you ever heard of plants that can eat insects? It may sound like something out of a science fiction movie, but it's actually true. One of the most famous insect-eating plants is the Venus flytrap, also known as a flytrap plant. The Venus flytrap gets its name from the Roman goddess of love and beauty, Venus, and the trap-like structure of its leaves, which resemble a traditional mousetrap. These plants are unique and fascinating, and in this essay, we will explore their interesting features, how they catch insects, and how they grow and survive. Flytrap plants are found in wetlands, bogs, and other moist areas in the southeastern United States, particularly in North and South Carolina. They have long, narrow leaves that are divided into two main parts, a flat, leaf-like section called the leaf blade, and a pair of trigger hairs at the end of the blade. The leaves also have a small stem-like structure called a petiole, which connects the leaf blade to the root system. Flytrap plants have evolved to catch insects in order to supplement the nutrients they get from the soil. They do this by using their modified leaves, which have evolved into traps. When an insect lands on the leaf, it touches the trigger hairs, which cause the leaf to snap shut. Once the trap is closed, the plant releases digestive enzymes to break down the insect and absorb the nutrients. The trap will stay closed until the plant has finished digesting its meal, which can take up to a week. Flytrap plants have evolved to survive in nutrient-poor environments by using their insect-catching ability to supplement their diet. They grow in nutrient-poor soil and rely on catching insects for nitrogen and other nutrients. In addition to their insect-catching ability, flytrap plants have also developed a unique method of photosynthesis. Rather than using the traditional method of photosynthesis where the leaves absorb sunlight, flytrap plants use their traps to photosynthesize. The traps are lined with chlorophyll, the pigment that absorbs sunlight, which allows the plant to make its own food. Flytrap plants also rely on their natural habitat to survive. They need moist, acidic soil to thrive, which is why they are found in wetlands and bogs. However, due to habitat destruction and poaching, many flytrap plant populations are in danger of extinction. Flytrap plants are fascinating and unique, with their ability to catch insects and their unique method of photosynthesis. They have evolved to survive in nutrient-poor environments by using their insect-catching ability to supplement their diet and they rely on their natural habitat to survive. While they may seem like a novelty, they play an important role in the ecosystem and are a valuable part of our natural world.